Hey guys, Family here today, and welcome back to Game Dev Tycoon. Are you? Yeah, we're waiting for people to come back from holiday. Gonna keep tycooning and deving uh, to make games, I guess. Uh, so, uh, one million sales. Good. That's all right. I'm. I'm I guess. I guess I'm kind of happy with that. Uh, Laureen. Wait, who was um good at? Wait. So we got 55 research points. Let me have a look at something. <clears throat> so I can make you a design specialist for. 5 million credits, 100 rep. Of oh, rep. <laughs> well, it shouldn't be RP. I've been playing too much GTA. RP means rep, not research points. Uh, so, I would like a design specialist, because that will unlock a few more things. What about you? What can you do for me? Technology. That's pretty good. So, are you the only good one at design? Oh, whoops. I just need to see. I can't remember who is who and where we're at. Your technology is good. I think we have a load more technology people than we have design. Oh, I keep doing the wrong thing. Uh, train. You design is okay. I'm going to get you to do a little bit more design work. Uh, do a little bit of that. There we go. Uh, what about you? Train. Mm, okay, maybe get your, maybe I'll get your design up as well, actually. Oh, I can't, I can't do that one. Do one of these, I guess. And then I can... Boost you on it. There we go. Uh, and then, I don't know. Well, I mean, I really should use research points. Uh, oh, a tablet device. Hmm, there you go. Uh, I really should use research points on uh, like creating new game engines. But, you know, well, it's one of those things. There you go. You do that. Uh, you guys do a little bit of work. Get your get your skills up. Uh, ne I think the next thing we'll spend research points on is either... Specializing Edwin Edwards or uh, just making a new engine and researching stuff for the new engine. I don't know. But we'll work on a new game in just a moment. Almost got a hundred million dollars. We are pretty good. Uh, graphics seems to be quite important for this type of game. Okay, cool. Right, well, let's develop a new game, I guess. Do I want contract work? Not really. Oh, uh, publishing deal? No. Developing, just just developing a new game. A lot, no, that's... Mm, let's go large. This, uh, so, what could be good? Let's go craft mine. And it's going to be, obviously, a, let's see, I don't know, comedy game, time travel game. So just a, uh, anything that would, I guess it could be city. Everyone, my, craft mine. That doesn't make any sense. City. It's going to be, uh, minor, borrow, Bike, I guess. City, uh, action, adventure? Or just action? Probably just action. Yeah, it's just city. Oh, I now have cancelled it. Ah, oh, that's annoying. New game. <laughs> uh, I don't even, did I ever done that game before in this series? Probably. I feel like I have. Let's do something else. Let's go for, um, we could do, I don't know. We could do like a roller coaster tycoon game, but I don't think I can really do that. Well, let's pick a topic. So, music is good for young. Maybe we'll do another music game. We've been a while since we've done one of those. Let's go music simulation. Casual? Still says great combo. Pick platform. So, wait, what are we. So, we're doing young. So, what's good for young? Not PC particularly. Probably the new would be good, I would imagine. Mm, but I don't know anything about it. Really, we want to do a mature action game on the Mbox. Or maybe casual. What's good for casual? PC, I know PC hates casual. Oh, we could probably, maybe we could try to do a, a phone game. Yeah, we'll do that. Uh, does not support large games. Medium games? They support medium games. So we want to do a casual game. Simulation casual. How about that? On the Gur phone. Uh, tap, tap to the beat. There you go. <laughs> That's going to be our mobile game. Uh, it's going to be for... Wait. Mu wait. Music is best for young. So let's go... Young. Pick engine. Obviously the latest engine. Sure. Why not? Uh, 3D... Oh, I don't need 3D graphics. Does it? Let's go 2D graphics V3. This is the dumbest thing I've ever done. <laughs> we might be inventing the free-to-play model right here. Uh, okay. So, 
Music simulation casual. Music simulation. Don't need stories and quests. Gameplay, I would imagine. Doesn't need a branching story. Advanced cutscene theater. It doesn't even need a story. But then maybe, I don't know if this game would think it needs a story. It's a save game, obviously, we want. Multiplayer would be good. Video playback would be good. But we don't need basic physics. Mod support, we don't need that. Save to cloud. I guess it could be useful. Tutorials, better user experience. Character progression, achievements. We don't need character progression. So, engine, we need more time put into that. Pretty much there. Bring gameplay down a little bit. Alright, so, engine. Uh, do we have our best tech guy on that? We do. Gameplay. I'm on that, apparently. I'm not even that good anymore compared to other people. Like, I'm pretty crap. Is gameplay design or tech? I don't know. I do not know. It's not going to put me on it anyways. Edwin Edwards, why would I waste you on stories and quests anyways? I thought I just put Lauren Camo on it. There we go, guys. Tap, tap to the beat. It's getting a little bit of hype, just general hype. 23 million in sales from uh, Kuvin Kites. Uh, oh, the the we knew, well, whatever they call it in this. I don't know. The new two. I don't know. Damn, there's a lot of bubbles. Okay. I'm not going to boost you just yet, buddy. Okay, so level design. Dialogues, I don't think so. I think AI and level design probably want to be up there. <clears throat> don't need any dialogues. Level editor could be good. Yeah, mini games. AI companions. Don't really need a companion. Just maybe better. Well, I guess if we're going for the best AI, maybe we will. Uh, so, we've got. You, well, you're better at tech, so why don't we chuck Johnny Rome on that? Uh, level design, Edwin Edwards. And dialogues, sure, you can do that. Well, maybe you'll do that. I'll give you, we'll give you something to do. There you go. Sure, this is gonna be, this is gonna be a good game. I feel it. I feel that this is gonna be, this is gonna be our big hit. You know? Well, we we make it to the to big leagues, even though we're kind of already there. Not really. All right, fifty-two bugs in it. Jesus. Okay, so world design, well, obviously sound. No stereo. Uh, graphics. Well design, maybe not so much. Day night cycle, rich backstory, no. Let's take well design down. Um, graphics and sound, maybe we'll bring graphics down a bit. Okay, so on graphics we're gonna get, so obviously Johnny Rome can't do our sound, which I feel is more of a design thing anyways. Sound design, wouldn't that make more sense? Um, so you're doing graphics, again, that feels like a design thing, so maybe if I get Oh, you're the best one for it anyways. And world design. Arena, 416. You're not very good. I'm better than you. There we go. Dakota Stokes, not doing anything. She'll eventually be good for something, I guess. I don't know. Um, not, not doing any advertising for this game, you may have noticed. I figured we'd wing it. You know, this is our first Gurufone, uh app. Do they really have to call it Gurufone in this? It's just... Just annoying to say. <laughs> Can they just call it G-Phone? The G Spot phone. The M Pad by Microsoft. That doesn't even make any sense. Why would they call it the M Pad? So obviously it's a Microsoft Surface. Couldn't they call it like the tabletop by Microsoft or something? I don't know. <laughs> something stupid. Oh, Microsoft Face. Microsoft Face, rather. I don't know. A little bit. Damn, look at me. Okay. Yeah, mixed reviews. I'm not making anything for that. Finish. There we go. Oh, almost, almost 300 technology. No new records there, though. Not a groundbreaking title, but it could be... Uh, casual games are still popular, right? You go on vacation, and you also go on vacation right now. Uh, let's see if we actually did any good with that. Kind of just completely 100% winging that title. Uh, could have been better. Yeah, a lot of things could have been better, but we do our best. Seven! That's not too bad. I mean, for an iPhone game. Well, sorry, a Guru phone game. G Spot game. Uh, you also go on a vacation. You generate me a game report. Get me some more info on that. Uh, I'm not going to use any of my research points just yet. I'm going to save them up a little bit. Okay. I don't don't want to decrypt it. I don't I don't want to don't want to sabotage. Damn, that's selling pretty well though for an iPhone game. I don't know what we're selling it for, but it's doing pretty well. There you go. I went that then. It's almost 500,000 sales, like that's not shabby at all. I'm over a hundred million dollars now. Um, I know stories and requests were not important, that's why I didn't do any. 
Oh yeah, the Woo by Ninvento has been released. Uh, okay. 500 can sales. Yep, I know all my competitors are jealous, so let's just go... Well, hang on, let's, let's see what we need to research uh, for a new engine. Well, what I want to research. A lot of things. Like, I need a lot of research points here. But apparently if we get a design specialist, they can also get us more research points. Uh, let's go... Maybe we'll do a contract work. No, not contract work. Contract work sucks. But I guess we could do it. Why not? Just do it. Just go, guys. I'll go medium booth. We should be able to do some of these. Because I guess these are good for getting research points. So maybe I'll just do a few of these. Wow, that was, that was, that was easy. We just destroyed that. And got like a little bit of money for it. Find contract work. Yeah, sure, I'll do that one. Go, guys. Yes! Oh, pff, that was so quick. Just a random game company doing all these random contracts. Damn, this this would have been impossible back in the day to do this many. 112 though. So, oh, Flabaliki Inc. Tap to the beat. And what's the other one? Kuven Kites is never something. I can't remember what I called the previous game. I mean, I could just look up. That is not a lot of people. 827,000. Could use more. Oh, well, actually, that's quite good. It was 59th. Uh, let's keep doing some of these. Find contract work. Well, what gives us eight weeks? Oh, that one looks pretty good. Let's do that one. Now, what I want you to do is train to be a design specialist. There you go. My first design specialist. That'd be nice. Well, everybody else is working on that. Yeah, you can boost for that. Sure. There you go. Work a little bit faster. Probably a waste of a boost, but that's all right. We'll use it anyways. Because I kind of need help to do this. Might not actually finish them. No, I think we'll finish it. We'll be fine. Or will we? I don't know. We don't have a lot of time left. Um, we can open our, okay, yeah, let's open our own research lab. Uh, R&D lab is ready. Uh, okay, so new research available, own convention, internet opportunities, hardware, AAA games. Uh, so this is how I get over to my research lab. At the moment it's empty, but we have a number of skilled people eager to start. Well, I don't want to actually hire anyone yet, is the thing, because I don't really have that much money. Um... Simply decide the budget from the R&D lab. The higher the budget, the more researchers will work, and the higher research progress will be. Running your own R&D lab can be very expensive, so be careful, don't overspend. Yep. Uh, to start a project, simply click on the screen to bring up the research menu. Once you start a project, you can also cancel by using the same menu. Oh, okay. Um, start project. So what can you do? Own convention. Oh, so you can just like research these sort of things. Uh, yeah, I don't want to do that yet, because we don't have that much money. How do we get back? Go back. Go back. Oh, there we go. Um, One million in sales! There you go, that's not bad. We got there in the end. One million for a mobile game, that's pretty damn good. Uh, let's do some more contract work, get some more research points while we're at it. Might as well. Okay. Uh, a little bit more, do that one there. And we just smash that one. Okay, let's... um. What can I even do in a custom engine that I don't already have? Like, there's nothing new. That's why, yeah, I've got nothing new in here. That's why we need to, re like, just get more point. Oh, just go on vacation for a little bit, and then we'll start a new project. And get back. Come on, guys. Dun, 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 dun. New will be taken up the market. Oh, no. What a shame. $1.1 million of tap tap to the beat. Such a dumb game name. I love it. All right, let's develop a new game. Uh, large game. Uh, let's go for a... Mm, let's do something we haven't done. Rhythm, no. Time travel. Wild West. I guess we could do it. We could try a Wild West game. Wild West RPG Adventure. On... I don't know if console the the, the Mbox 360 likes the uh, what about the oh PC likes adventure? You can do that. Uh, does PC like RPG? It does. Okay, RPG adventure and PC it is. Uh, using the old engine, this is going to be uh, hmm. quick draw. Uh, quick draw. Trying to think of something cool. No, nope, can't think of anything cool. 
quick, just quick draw. That's it. That's it. That's all it's gonna be. Because I can't think of anything better to go after it. 3D graphics. Damn, there's some old 3D graphics. We, we need more research points, really. Okay, so stories and quests, gameplay obviously is pretty important too. Engine is pretty, I would say, is pretty important. Uh, so what we want to do, uh, we want a branching story, advanced cutscenes for sure. Now let's let's start from scratch here. What do we want? We want save game. We definitely want physics. Uh, don't really need mod support. We could go with multiplayer. Um, character progression we definitely want. So maybe bring the engine down there a little bit. See that this is over. I'll get rid of game. Oh, you need tutorials though. Better user experience. Damn, I don't know. Maybe we just leave it like that. I don't know. Okay, so stories and quests. You, you imagine you want the best one on design doing that. I would imagine, anyways. You can do that. Uh, although, no, I'd rather you doing something else, but it's pretty important, so actually I will keep you on that. Gameplay can be you, engine, who's my best tech guy, you are, no, you're already on it, cool. Alright, go. Nice, get that hype built, I haven't even done anything yet. Uh, while you only need one specialist to start running a lab, you can train more than one. Additional specialists uh, decrease the overall running cost of your lab. Oh, cool, nice to know. Quick draw. Wild West RPG Adventure. This is going to be a good game. Hopefully. We will, I think we'll open, we'll start using the R&D lab, maybe if we get to $150 million, I reckon. Alright, level design I think would be pretty important. And also AI. See, all this stuff I feel like is important to this sort of genre. Maybe level design isn't that important. Um... Dialogue tree. Everything is equally done there. Okay. Dialogues. So, who do we have on that? Rena. Your design is not that good. Maybe we get Lorene on there. Oh, it's too much for Lorene. Um, I'll put myself on that then. Uh, level design. What's about Edwin Edwards? That's too much for Edwin though. Overworks. Maybe Lorene? Oh, 103. We could probably adjust that in a second. And Johnny Rome is on the AI. Might actually put you on that. Maybe to save you up for the next one. What is next? Sound and stuff. Ooh, I don't think I really have anyone that's going to be able to work on sound that well. Oh well. <laughs> it's one of those things. Uh, so Lorene, you need to get... Let's try and get you to 100. Like that. See, I feel AI is probably quite important. Maybe it's not that important. It's quite important though. Let's go there. I don't need a level editor. I'll get rid of that. Um, yeah, let's go with that. Cool. All right. Uh, this is going to be... Uh, new is no longer supported. Uh oh. Don't think we ever developed anything for that. How come I never see anyone grabbing a soda or going to play on the TV? Always working. We've got hard workers. Let's go marketing. Small campaign for this. Maybe we'll do a larger one later. Okay. Uh, yeah, sure. <clears throat> uh, can you tell us w uh, whether such a game would usually receive more focus on artificial intelligence? Oh, stories and quests, obviously. Yeah, you're welcome. You're very welcome. Okay, so... Well designed, hell yeah. <clears throat> Graphics, pretty important. Sound is also pretty important. Open world, day night. Ridge back. Now is the uh, the way we try and do this up. Um, so, Rena. Oh God, yeah, this isn't. This didn't end up in a good position at the end. Uh, <laughs> Let me get Rena on that. One hundred and twenty. <laughs> Yeah, this is, uh, this is not gonna. I guess it's not that bad if you overwork them, right? <laughs> I don't know. I might as well overwork myself. No, I'll overwork Arena. Screw Arena. I don't like her, anyways. Yeah, that didn't do too well. Uh, yeah, cool. And let's go marketing. Let's also do it. Let's ramp up the campaign now. There we go. This could be a, a large letdown of a game though, so I'm not sure. 
I'll give you a little boost. Sure. Do a little bit better. 220 hype. 220 hype! Oh! Uh, I'm not sure if that's a new design record. I have no idea what it was prior to this, but uh, hopefully it squash all those bugs. And hopefully Quick Draw is a good game, because I don't know what else to do with that. I mean, didn't have great management with it, so it's anyone's guess right now. Adding new features, just having a little bit of fun. You know, we're delaying the game because we want to add new things to it, guys. Uh, okay, finish there. New record for design! Yes! Dialogues level up, level up. Oh no, that means we're gonna. Un oh, first of all, we gotta pay those two more people more things. Salary increase. Psh. New research, good, because I can research all the things. All right, let's see. Uh, see how that went. <clears throat> uh, not, not bad. Not bad. Mm. Eight. I, I'm, I'm quite content with an eight. Eight, I'm happy with. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not sad about that at all. Eight is good. Eight is good. Alright, so what we're going to do is you are going to generate me a game report on that. Uh, you are going to... What can we research? Multi-platform, full motion video... Oh, there's a lot of... There's basically just a lot of stuff that it costs a lot of research points here. Dynamic environment, skill trees, online play... We need all of this stuff. 3D graphics V4 would probably be useful. Let's get that. And we have 60 points for something else. Do we actually have anything for 60 points? Or less than, or oh, virtual economy we can do. Advanced stereoscopic 3D, well that's just a waste of my time. I'm not gonna research that. Let's get our virtual economy. Then Johnny Rome. Uh, I'm going to technology. Can I not, um? You're over 700 in technology, why can't I, uh, like, train you in that? Maybe any more points for- No, it showed up before though, didn't it? I don't know. Well, I can't do that anyways. Who's- who's crap? Are you crap? 539, yeah, you're pretty crap. See, how come you- oh, maybe you already specialized him in tech. Maybe. Probably did, I guess. Um... You can... Do some more tech. No, I need to go to one of these. More tech. What can I do? Because I'm pretty crap as well. Uh, let's get my design up. Let's go some design. There you go. A bit here and there. Oh, the quick draw is selling all right. It's not. It's not exactly a really hot off the press of seller. Over five hundred thousand though. So that's pretty good. Uh, seems to have no end. Well, it definitely does have an end because it will not go forever. Uh, Laureen, what can you do? You need more design, that's what you need. Waste some more research points on that. There we go. Uh, it's a good combination. Well, design seems to be very important. Yeah, well, I figured as much. Uh, might as well send some more research points on you for some more design. Why not? There you go. Uh, let's go medium booth. 101 million dollars. That's good. We're back above the 100 mark. Uh, so, okay, when everyone's finished their little things, you go on a vacation because you're a little bit tired. Ooh, poor you, you're so tired. I never have a vacation. I'm always sitting at my desk. I never move! I'm so good. Uh, over 1 million in sales. That's good. Nice. Good old quick drop. You go on vacation too, please. I wonder if there's more contract work. We might check that out. Just get some more research points. Uh, here we go. See how many people we get there. Decent number, or better than last time at least. Oh, that's better than last time, so that's good. Uh, 47. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Okay, can you have him finish? Alright, can we do any contract work? Oh, we can. Let's do some of that. Okay. Get your brain juices flowing. Yep, there you go. I don't need it for the money, I just want the research points. Can I just buy research points, please? That's what I would rather do. <laughs> that takes like two seconds to do that one. <laughs> Contract work, that one. There we go. Get, oh, getting all them research points. Find contract work, that one. Just do all of these again. Now, maybe we'll do another publishing deal. For a bit of fun. That's a bit of a change. Um, What is it? Oh, is this the Ooyah? <laughs> Out of nowhere, a new company called Kick It! 
has uh, kicked up a media storm by successfully crowdfunding the development of a new gaming console just under eight hours. Uh, is dubbed Oya. Is similar. Yeah, it's also a fail, so I will not be developing any games with that <laughs> at all. It's a complete 100% utter fail. Quick, don't have a lot of time left. Oh, you finished it. Nice job, guys. My team knows no bounds. Simulation games. Ooh. Uh, fun contract. Let's do that last one real quick. Cool. Alright, now what we're going to do, let's see if we can find a publishing deal for a medium, medium, large, min score 5 from Ubisoft. Uh, we could do that. On the, uh, what is this? Just Mbox 360, yeah. Okay. So, a dungeon simulation. Uh, simulation... Strategy? Simulation adventure? Does that even mix? A simulation adventure? I guess, a dungeon simulation. What the hell is a dungeon simulation? Action simulation. Sure, that sounds good. Really need a new game engine. Uh, the, the, du oh, dungeoning. Cool. Can I be mature? Wait. Well, I don't know who likes, um, no, I want to see who likes what. Mature, maybe everyone. We'll go everyone. Uh, 3D graphics V3, which are a little bit dated. Yep, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. So this has to at least be rated 5 when we're done with it. So let's see if we can do something good here. Uh, simulation. Engine. An action gameplay. So let's take stories and quest down a little bit. We'll go linear story, simple cutscenes. Uh, okay, we're gonna go to. I mean, any mod support, multiplayer, save game. Yeah, that's all good. All that kind of, all that kind of good stuff. Okay, so engine, Edwin Edward, good stuff, good stuff. Uh, actually, why is Edwin Edwards on the engine? No, he's not. He's over there. Sorry. <laughs> I was confused. Johnny Rome on the engine, if I could look properly. Yeah, he's on it. He's on it. Gameplay, Lorene Camo on design. Um, I'll put myself in that, actually. Uh, yeah. I'll put myself in that. Cool, let's go. This is going to be a good game. Popular genre is simulation. All the simulators are coming out now. Okay, 1.4 and 19 million sales. Not too shabby, guys. Not too shabby. Well, oh, that, that guy produced an 8. Dakota Stokes producing all the 8s. Good stuff. We already had 150 on each. Okay. Now, simulation action. Dialogues, I'm going to say no. I'm going to say artificial intelligence, yes. Level design? Mm, a little bit. So, uh, we can do a level editor. No, we don't need that. So I'm on dialogues. Uh, maybe Edwin Edwards goes in dialogues. No, we'll save him for later. We'll put someone less good at anything on that. Uh, level design. Who's on level design? Lorraine Camel. 567. Yeah, sure. Artificial intelligence is Rena. You're pretty good. Maybe Johnny Rome could do that though. No, no, no. He can't do that. All right, you can do that. Ah, that's good. I'm happy with that. I'll give you a two times boost. Yeah, you as well. Why not? Oh, might as well uh, use your boosts. Well, we can, I guess. Make you a little bit more productive. Sure. Uh, hype. Already got a lot of hype, even though we haven't done anything. So let's uh, let's do a large campaign for it as well. Okay. So, uh, simulation action. Graphics. I reckon all these things are important for a simulation action. All three of these. Maybe world design. Maybe graphics number one. Okay, now, world design, we need someone good on design on that, so Rena is on that currently, but she's a little overworked. Edwin Edwards is on sound, I'm gonna take him off sound, I'm gonna put Rena on sound. No, that's still too much, for, that's too much for the old Reen dog. What about if I put Laureen on there? And on graphics I put Rena. That doesn't really help. Someone's gonna be overworked here, or I put someone crap on graphics. Well, Edwin Edwards, maybe you go on there and then... You go on there, because that's graphics is the most important. That's a little bit of that's a that's a better balance. So we'll go with that. Okay. We're overworking too many people. I need maybe I should hire another person finally. Get someone good at design as well, or maybe tech. I can't remember who I need. Uh, engine sell sell it. 
give it away? Yeah, whatever. I don't need that. Uh, yeah, gave away engine. Cost us minus 2.3k. Whoa, watch out. Lost $2,300. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of bugs too, Jesus. This better be at least a 5. A 5 rated game, guys. Do you wanna... You can go vacation, mid development, sure. There you go. <laughs> Just leaving. Eh, I don't think bug fixing, that'd be cool. There's no deadline for this game, so screw it. Do what we want. You know who I is, I is Flabaliki. Flabaliki Inc. That's what we do at Flabaliki Inc. We take holidays during game development. Finish. Alright. Two new records, double new records, that's good stuff. A lot of level up there, which means there's also going to be a lot more things we're going to have to unlock before we want to make a new engine. Uh, new, oh, only one. Cooperative play, okay. Get a bit of co-op, that took us a long time to get that. Anyone want to release that game? Here it is. Uh, looking pretty good! Uh, eight! Uh, looks like there's more tens in there, maybe a nine, maybe a ten is in order. Nine, one of the best! Oh, Ubisoft is gonna be so happy about this. Yeah, you're welcome, Ubisoft. Uh, Flabberleaky Inc. Oh, well, all games is a bit of a douche, so we don't have to listen to them. But that should sell quite well, especially with a publishing deal. Um, oh, well, the, the market trend just normalized as well. Look forward to future business. Well, you're welcome. There goes the sales. How much should we actually get from that? Not a lot of money. 3.5 million in sales for that. <laughs> yeah, we didn't get a lot of 3.6. It's all right. Uh, okay, what we're going to do. Any more contract deals or contract work? Oh, there is. Let's do some more of those. So we can just get some more research points in between game development. Okay, do a little bit more. Contract work. Do a little bit more. There we go. Can I just... No, I can't. I can't do another one in the middle. Selling 11.2 million dollars. At least it should be getting quite a lot of fans though, which is good. Yeah, we're getting fans every time, that's good. Oh, whoops. And almost done. Oh, no, we're not gonna make it! Didn't make it! No. Okay, well, I don't really care. Uh, we'll, do, we'll do a medium booth. We don't really have any games in the works right now. Can't believe we didn't make that one, guys. Come on, pick up the pace! Minus three technology. How did that even happen? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, still good. Uh, more contracts. Oh yeah. Debug program. Um, the slow demise of the PC gaming. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, PC market is so good. What are you talking about, dude? Uh, fine contract work. Do you have one there? Yeah. Thank you. Got 200 research points. So we can research two large uh, sort of things in a minute. Uh... Let's go. What am I doing? Uh, contract work. A little bit more. Hun almost $120 million though, thanks to the dungeoning, which is pretty good. Uh, that's Fabliki Inc. The dungeoning and quick draw. I wish I, 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 I don't understand why I still can't make sales on your old games. Come on, guys. Why can't I still sell? Oh, we had over a million people at our booth this time. First time ever. 28th. Nice. Okay. So what we're going to do, uh, you or just get any random person, research. Let's see, what do we want? Oh, multi-platform, hello. No, okay, let's get some stuff that's more important first. Realistic weather, maybe? Dynamic environment? Uh, online play, voiceover, sound, stories and quests. Um, let's go, let's work our way up. Let's do, why did I click you again? Uh, research, then you can do dynamic environment. We have 40 points, but I don't think I can really research anything else, can I? Because uh, there's nothing else. I mean, I could research stereoscopic 3D if I really wanted, but I don't want to. <laughs> At all. <laughs> new topic, maybe. We're going to do a new topic. Let's go for... Let's go Game Dev. We can make Game Dev Tycoon. Watch out. Um, and then... Maybe Dakota Stokes? No, not research, sorry. Uh, train... What do you got at tech? You need a bit more tech. Um, there you go. I'm gonna get. Wait, so. Is, I wish there was like just a view I could view all my staff. And like all their skills. Oh, staff list? <laughs> yeah. Good job, me! Uh, okay. What? That's not. Speed. Oh, no, that's speed. Right. Design 549. 
398. So we have a lot of people that are good. At, so we have, okay, one tech, one, 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 two design, one tech, three. Yeah, we need another design person. So I'm going to hire, let's see if we can fill position. Let's go maybe show reel, game demo. Show reel, I think, for design. So we need people that are good at design. We kind of like, we're kind of running out of <laughs> people to, to work on design in our games is the problem. Let's see what we get. $118 million. All right, so design 565, 551, 617, 690. I'm going to go Louise Collier. 38k a month. You're only level four, which is actually kind of good. I'm going to hire you. Uh, have a maximum number of employees. Wow, you can only have six employees. That's kind of lame. Um, uh, train staff welcome. You need to go on vacation. Or not. Can't, can't send you on vacation. Can't send you on vacation. Can't send you on vacation. Why is everybody so exhausted? I mean, I am as well. I'm not doing anything. I don't know. She's having a good time though. I don't know. Let's, uh, okay. So the dungeoning is now off the market. It sells 16.2 million units and generate 22 million in sales for us. That's all we got. <laughs> Okay, that's um, 422,000 monthly cost. Wow. Are you done yet? You need to go on vacation. So is everybody else just sort of warming up? I guess so. Any more con- oh, not custom engine. Any more contract work? Oh, there is. Cool, let's do a little bit more of that. Look at everybody sort of, you know, warmed up, loosey-goosey. Oh wow, that was quick. Ready to go. Um, for a new game. Be a new day and a new game. Well, seven research points. Watch out, guys. That's pretty crazy. And a horoscope generator is what we're making now. Jesus. <laughs> what does Flabaliki Inc. come to? Generating, hor making horoscope generators. Um, let's do that one there. Yeah, she's getting used to the workplace. She loves it. We've got such a diverse group of staff. Look at this. So good. Uh, let's see, find contract work, no more, let's just finish all these off. There we go. I mean, these things don't even cover my monthly costs, but that's not really a problem. Uh, sometimes you just want to play something unique, a game based on an idea that's not usually merely through action fantasy. Name two examples, I really hope companies bring something new to the market soon. Yeah. Alright, well let's, when we do this, which we're not going to finish. We didn't finish that. It was too big of a job for me. Uh, develop a new game. We're going to go medium because we want to finish this before the trend uh, normalizes. So, a strange combination. We could do a detective... Oh, God, that sounds boring. Detective simulation. <laughs> that just sounds like Elena Noir. Uh, no, let's do a um, oh, strange combination. Romance action game. <laughs> romance strategy. <laughs> romance adventure. A romance RPG adventure. How about that? For, it probably should be mature audiences, I would imagine. Uh, okay, so on PC, we got mature. RPG is good. Adventure is good. Sure, here we go. Love Guru. There we go. Because that's not a movie title. Uh, 3D graphics, of course. Jeez, oh, what, what are we making? What are we making? All right, the romance adventure RPG, adventure RPG. Uh, let's bring that down. I reckon gameplay is probably pretty big. Okay, so we want to go advanced cutscene, branching story, of course. Uh, we don't need multiplayer. Get rid of multiplayer. Let's go say game basic physics, video playback. No, get rid of that. Okay, achievements. We don't need achievements. Game tutorials, but user experience. Yeah, whatever, that'll be fine. Okay, so now, now we've got new people in here. Louise is pretty damn good at design, so maybe uh, she goes on to gameplay instead of me. Um, engine, Johnny Rhyme. Yeah, that's good. Go that. <laughs> Why is this getting high? <laughs> <laughs> the love guru of romance adventure RPG. This is ridiculous. Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, yeah. 
Uh, I'm always open to interviews. Okay. Uh, more on gameplay, of course, obviously. Not all about graphics, people. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so dialogues, hell yeah. Oh, we should have called it like Fifty Shades of Games. Oh, that would have been a better title. Oh, we can make a sequel. Uh, <laughs> Easter, we don't need Easter eggs. No, we'll get rid of minigames. Keep Easter eggs. AI oh, yeah, can be pretty up there. Um, AI hey, companion. Well, you need AI hey, companions. It's a romance game, right? It's like the definition of it. Uh, okay, so we seem to be having a pretty good load right now. Uh, design. We could get Edward and Edwards on it. Maybe we'll save him for the better stuff, though. 549. Uh, artificial intelligence is Rena. Tech. We could probably put Johnny Rome on that. No, no, no. No, we'll put you on there. It's good management. You know, to have a nice even spread. Except for Dakota. Dakota never really seems to do anything. Maybe I should get rid of them. I don't know. He's a good member of the team, though. I like Dakota. Just need to train him up a little bit more. 100 research points. Oh, no. The Unbox 1 is coming soon. Oh, wait. We're developing this on PC. We're good. We're good. I guess the PS4 will be announced. Yep, there it is. Uh, play System 4. Yeah, yeah, okay, whatever. It's nice that they updated the game to include the new consoles, actually. Because I remember when I played this the first time around, obviously those hadn't been announced yet, so... I went in it. Uh, okay, so... Romance... Uh, world design? I don't know, adventure RPG, I guess so. I feel like all of this is important, though. Get rid of soundtrack. Doesn't need to be open world. Do, 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 do. World design can be Edwin Edwards. Uh, on graphics, we'll get uh, Louise. Dakota Stokes can go. No, you're not even good at design. Lorene. Oh, I'll go on that. No, well, you have better design, actually. You go on that. Let's do that. Let's do marketing. Here we go. A large campaign. Let's try and get this game out before Strange Combinations disappears, otherwise we might have just dug in- DUG IN?! We might have- we might have just dug in ourselves a hole. Cause that's a word. Come on, let's squish those bugs, guys. No new records have been made in technology or design this time around, but... That's one of those things. Oh, that's a lot of bugs. Hurry up. Public backlash, the controversial feature. Yeah, classic. Good times. Yeah, I'm not reading all that. <laughs> Finish! Oh, it was a new record design. How about that? I thought we got to 500 before. I guess not. Oh well. No loading screens. Oh. Release a game! Hurry up! Oh no. <laughs> Fun at stages. Love Guru. <laughs> uh, well, it's a strange combination, right? I don't know. I don't know if they actually counts as a strange combination. Hey, we got a six from all games. So that's something. Send on vacation. Send on vacation. Uh, research. Let's see. What have we got? So we can do 280 research things. 280 research points. Skill trees. Online play. Maybe we'll do those two. So you do that. You research. Online play. You generate game report on the dungeoning. A new generate game report on Love Guru. And I can just sit there looking pretty. Nice. Well, it's all better the second week, so that's good, right? I mean, people are buying it, so that's something. Uh, let's get Medium Booth again. G we always come around to G3 and we don't really have a game uh, that's sort of ready for it. It's a good combination, not a great combination. I think was, uh, he's, having a, he's having a fun time over there. Cool. Alright. So, well, we might as well develop another... Let's, maybe a sequel. No, we still have a... We still have a crap engine, though. Let's do another publishing... No, contract work? Let's do more contract work. Let's get some more uh, research points. Then maybe we'll do a publishing deal again. Uh, at least... If, if Love Guru can hit 500k, I'll be happy. It's about to, so that's good. Has been released. Damn, that was quick. Time flies. Time really flies when you're having fun. The year's already gone by. Um, here we go. G3. Uh, this might boost our sales of Love Guru. 
Uh, we make games like the Dungeoning, which are fantastic, and then we make games like Love Guru, which are like, uh, what are you doing, bro? Place 28th. Did we actually finish that? Oh, we just did. Uh, contract. We got eight weeks to do that. That's heaps of time. Damn. Oh, yeah, look, there you go. G3 boosted our sales of Love Guru. So good. Oh, yeah, it's going to so many sales. 85 research points. Cool. We've almost got enough for another one. Well, I mean, I guess we could do an 80 research point thing. Uh, we really want to get 100. 100 research points. Research the good stuff. Contract work! Game backdrops. <laughs> that was easy. Didn't even get any research points for that. <laughs> Time tracking. Research points? Oh, there we go. 87, 89. Nice. 91. Uh, and the last one, Sprite Sheet Software. Done. <laughs> okay, let's, um... Well... Not train, what am I saying? Uh, research? Multi-platform, maybe? Orchestral Soundtrack? Uh, voice... Well, let's get rid of all the 80 research points ones. Simple Body Language VoiceOver. Surround sound. Let's go voiceover first. We're still not even using any of these yet. Oh, a play system's released. Nice. Uh, no, uh, 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 sound on vacation. Seven point six million in sales. Not too bad. We're still at a hundred over a hundred million dollars. I, I consider if we release a game and we're still over a hundred million dollars in cash, I'm happy. <laughs> at least at the, this point in time. Oh, can everybody stop getting a little bit tired? Just go on vacation. Just take like a day off and you'll be fine. That's pretty much all you need. And fading back in. Alright, let's go find publishing deal. Uh, anything on Xbox One? Oh, we could do this one. Large game. Uh, Lowwood Productions. Who the hell are they? Micronoft. Oh, we could do a first party game for Micronoft. Well, not really first party, but you know what I mean. Mystery, not researched. Mystery casual. No license. Well, let's, um, can we research mystery? No, oh, we can. There we go. Let's get that done then. Let us accept that deal from, uh, Micronoft for the Xbox One. Oh, Mbox One! Mbox One, of course. Oh, that means if people do YouTube videos of this Mbox One game from Microsoft Studios, they'll have to put the, uh, little copyright information in the description these days. Okay, uh, oh. Fine, publishing deal. Uh, oh, they've all changed, okay. Oh, no, here we go. Oh, now it's airplane! I haven't researched airplane! Micronoft! Can I research it? No, I don't have any points. Damn it. God damn it, Micronoft! Well, I guess I could just select one of the ones where you can just select anything. Ninja Adventure. The hell is a Ninja Adventure? Oh, I don't even have Ninja researched. Alright. Develop new game. <laughs> Develop my own one then. With blackjack and hookers. It's gonna be a mystery... Mm, adventure. Strategy. On. No, that's a, that's a dumb game. That is a dumb game. <laughs> well, let's go Mbox. Uh, yeah, I got one million dollar license for that. Let's go, now. let's go Mystery Adventure. Oops, sorry, Adventure. Oh! Action. Action Adventure. Yeah. On my old engine that I've been using for years. <laughs> Why? I shouldn't- maybe I should just make a new engine. Yeah, screw it, let's make a new engine. Develop a new engine. Create custom engine. What are we at? What is that F- oh. What- what is the name of my engine? Oh, jeez. I don't even know. F4, okay, so we're up to F3. Oh, okay, no, I see how to do it. F1, F2, F3. Okay, this will be a new engine because we're going to have new graphics, so it's going to be F5 engine. Alright, create custom engine. There you go. F5. Alright, let's, uh, let's keep 2D graphics in there. We like it a little bit 2D. We'll get better 3D. Keep all of that. Online play as well, add that in. Skill trees, add that in. Voiceovers. Oh, voiceovers, add that in. Dynamic environments, virtual economy, realistic weather. Don't want mono sound though. Yeah, 1.7 million dollar engine. Let's go! <sighs> Getting some research points for it too, which is also handy. Boost you up, do some more stuff. Faster. 
Uh, we would like to stage an internal coding contest. I think we could all learn a lot by doing this. As an incentive, we would need a prize for the winner. The winner, 90k. We agreed that the prize would go to charity. Should we do it? What's the point of having a prize? You might as well say we're donating to charity. Sure, whatever. Can you- Why did you decide to do this in the middle of our engine development? I want you to all do it because we all sort of upgrade our research and everything, but... Like, could you not do it in the middle of engine development when we have no games for sale? <sighs> whatever. Idiots. Idiots. 49.6 million on the Mbox 360. Wow, that's pretty good. So they want a... Odd combination, strange combinations again. Well, let's wait till they all do this already. Oh, look at all those beautiful numbers! Nice. Some people are slow. I wonder who won. <laughs> Character progression, adding it in. Damn, Louise Collier. Slow. Dakota Stokes is the worst of everyone. Your, yeah, your speed is not very good. I need to upgrade- I need to upgrade some of their speed. Uh, we've also learned a lot in the process. Good. Damn, you are- you are very tired. I'm gonna send you on vacation. Yeah. Cool. Uh... Alrighty. Virtual economy being added in. F5 is now complete. Good. Alright, come back from vacation, doll. Oh, we might as well- Wait. I don't want to start without him. Oh, is there any more contract deal? We can just do some of that. There you go, do that. I can almost <laughs> research more stuff again. Good. Alright, develop new game. Here we go. Pick topic. It is going to be a... It's not going to be mystery. It's stupid. Let's go city. Action. Uh, no, just be city action. That's all it will be. On the Mbox One. Uh, on the F5 engine. Uh, City Slicker. It's gonna be a large game. It's gonna be mature. Uh, 3D Graphics V4. Hello, new graphics! Ooh, exciting. New graphics, everybody. Finally. Uh, engine. It's apparently pretty important. I would imagine so. Uh, stories and quests. Probably not so much. Simple cutscenes. Linear story. Gameplay. Probably pretty action. Uh, action? Pretty uh, important too. Alright, so what can we select? Multiplayer. Uh, online play, hell yeah. Oh, okay, so multiplayer replaces online too. Okay, yep. So let's go online play. I probably shouldn't have included multiplayer here. Save to cloud. Maybe get rid of save game. Why do you need save game and save to cloud? Oh, I guess if you want to play offline. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, okay, what can we do in here? Skill trees. Uh, achievements. I can't do everything though. It's the annoying thing. So let's get rid of... But what is better user experience? Like, I don't really know. No, I want character progression. I'm gonna get rid of those two, but then I want those two. Um, I don't know. I can't do mods to put that. Uh, I guess I can get rid of. See, I want skill trees because it's new. Maybe I don't need skill. No, but I want skill trees. Character progression. I don't know. Achieve? No, you need achieve. You can't not have achievements. Uh, eh, well. Mm, let's go to skill tree. Fine, we won't do skill tree. Okay, so engine is my best tech guy. It's obviously you, 755, and you are totally on that. Um, gameplay, Louise is on that. Yeah, you are. Edwin Edwards. I'm going to put you on that. And I'm going to put someone that's alright. I'm going to put me. I'm alright. I know I don't really need to worry about it. There we go. Yeah, working guys. City Slicker. A city action game. It's underway. Let's go large booth. Hell yeah. Let's pump it up. Hype up this game. It's not really a strange combination though. I know people are into that. A lot of bugs. Uh, a lot of bugs in this game. Wow, this is taking a long time to make too. Alrighty. So... Dialogues are not important at all. Uh, AI is the most important. Let's go with voiceovers. No, there's no why would you do voiceovers if we're having dialogues are not important? We'll go better dialogues. Uh, level design is pretty important. Dynamic environment. Uh, mini games. No, we're going to mini games. We'll keep Easter eggs. Mm, that looks pretty good to me. Okay, so 
AI, we really want... I guess you're good, 650, because Johnny Rome's already done. He's... He's dusted his hands of everything. Level design, I'm going to put Louise onto that. Uh, dialogues, I will put uh, Loreen onto that. A little bit of work for you. There you go, guys. Nice. It's good stuff. So when is... Uh, uh, G3 should be soon. It should be near the... Oh, I just can say. It should be near the end of development. It's almost... We're kind of midway. Kind of midway. It's pretty good. Got a nice big booth. City Slicker! A big sign for City Slicker at the top. 1.3 million visitors to check out City Slicker. Uh, we were voted number one booth this year. Oh, hello. That's good. Nice. Alright, moving into the final stage of development. Uh, world design, not too important. Maybe about just below halfway. Sound design, probably about there. Okay. Now, graphics. Uh, Louise is a little bit busy. Maybe I'll put myself in there, actually. Yeah, that's a bit better. Uh, world design, Edwin Edwards. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, a little bit of work. That's not too bad. Realistic weather. Virtual economy. Okay, well, we can't do all this. Okay, let's, let's, let's go back to basics. So, world design, it's a city action game. Let's go. We don't need a rich backstory. Day, night cycle, open world. Realistic weather? No. We, we can't have that in there. Just... Well, design is not that important. So, <laughs> soundtrack for sound. Hell yeah. 3D graphics V4. Alright, that looks pretty good to me. Let's go with that. Let's get this underway. Uh, Play System 3 will be taken off the market. Play System 3 is not taken off the market now. I can still go to the store and buy it. Why is it? Why is this game taking it off the market? Uh, marketing. Uh, let's go for a... Where's like a super duper campaign? I want a super duper one. Two million is not for a, not a lot for an advertising campaign. Over 300 hype for uh, arguably probably going to be average game because we don't have any particular records on either design or technology going on right now. Like we've always hit 500 before, so that's nowhere near any, techno uh, any technology or design record. <sighs> that's all right. It's one of those things, you know, we do our best. City Slicker might be an average game, but you know, it's one of those things. We do have 250 research points though, so that is good. Let's keep adding. Oh, new bugs. Play System 3 is no longer supported. People keep adding stuff. I'm going to boost you. I don't think they'll do anything. That's probably just a waste of my time. I'm going to send you on vacation. And you just created a bug. I'm going to send you on vacation too. I'm going to release that now. Yep, no new records. Didn't think so. New combo though, so that's good. A couple of level ups and 3D graphics. Uh, paying you some more money now. Well, you know, it's one of those things. Uh, okay, let's see how that did. Six, quirky but good. That's alright. Mm, that is not as good. Action games work well in Mbox One. Well, that's not really a review of my game. Uh, you're just sidestepping saying anything about my game by saying action games work well. Oh uh, dear. Alright, let's um, train you. You can do a little bit more in technology. You really need more speed. I'm going to do speed on you, actually. You're slow. What about you? You got really good speed. And good tech. Damn, you're good. Damn, son, you're good. Level 3. Uh, no, I want to... No, I don't want to do that. I don't want to train anyone else. Let's research some more stuff. Multi-platform. Uh, research. Interactive story. Full motion video. What else do we got? Do we got? What do we have? Um, we need some more stuff in... Probably, uh, I guess stories and quests. Interactive story. Moral choices. Okay, full motion video. And then maybe we can do, oh yeah, if you generate a game report. That'll be good too. Uh, not selling that well, but it's, uh, it's one of those things, I guess. Uh, I'm going to get you to train. Uh, you could do a little bit more, a little bit more speed as well, so you do that one. What about me? I'm gonna, I could just do more all around, really. I can specialize in world design if I have 200 RP points. Jesus. Um, let's go game design course. Nope, can't do it. Need more research points. Let's go G3 Pixel Cup. Sure. Uh, racked up 500k in sales. Well... Not that good. $108 million though. 
There we go. So we researched a couple new things. You're getting a little bit faster because you were awfully slow, and so are you. You got some full motion video. You're gonna go on vacation now. Thank you. Thank you. Have a nice day. Goodbye. Leave. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Um. Okay, I'm doing pretty well. Almost 600. Good job, me. Yeah, 600 design. I'm almost like somewhat decent. Uh, train. You could do some more design as well, because then once you get 700, we can uh, make you a design specialist as well. And I'm wondering if maybe we have 112 million, but we might go and we could risk uh, doing a project. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Um, but this has been an extraordinarily long episode of Game Dev Tycoon. It kind of just got away from me. I just started playing and uh, kept going. Um, <laughs> I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. Of course, comments, suggestions, feedback uh, down below. I will see you next time and have an awesome day.